playing for about 14 years. Yeah, it seems like you've been playing for like your entire life. I can't play guitar. Wow, where's your mic? Um, um, it's up there, so it's there. I can't play guitar. That's okay. You can play other things. Yeah. Don't you? Yes. You yeah. do interviews and stuff, so. Yeah. So, uh, where are you from? I'm from uh, Silver Spring, Maryland. Really? I oh, went wow. to Maryland. I lived in Silver Spring, Maryland. No, you're kidding. Yeah, Hampshire West Apartments. You know them? No, but... Really? They're in Silver Spring. I know that beltway. Really? Like yeah. 505, that area there? Yeah. It's like 20 minutes outside of D.C. Yeah. yeah. I, I spent a lot of time in D.C. I lived like right off of 29, or 29 there. Near the Mormon place? Yeah. Yeah. The Mormon Tabernacle. Yeah. Yeah, of course. It's yeah. Mormon family. There is. There's a huge, huge, huge bunch of Mormons in, in that area. So I worked at White Flint. Oh, really? Like Rockville? Yeah. yeah. I used to wait tables at, at the P.F. Chang's there. You know, oh, the, 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 the I don't know. It was a long time ago, probably before you were born. You're moving home. Yeah, where are you? Where yeah, are you moving on up. up. Yeah, so yeah, when, did, when did you move to New York? I moved here about a year ago, last July. For Fame and Fortune? Fortune? Uh, yeah, I went to music school, and, you know, this is one of the places they told us to go. So. Where'd you go? No. <laughs> I went oh, to, uh, nice to uh, Berkeley College of Music. That's up there, though. But Boston. Boston. Yeah, it's, a, it's in Boston. Yeah, I know Berkeley. So are you a snob? Uh, there's a lot of Berkeley snobs, yeah. Yeah, it has that, you know, you say Berkeley, well, it's Boston like, Boston in general. Yeah. Boston no. in general. No, well, but Berkeley is pretty, you have to be a really talented snoop. Yeah. Or, or, you know, yeah, or you got to know someone. Or, or you drop rich. out and become John Mayer. John Mayer, right. Yeah, exactly. yeah. yeah. he's yeah. a snoop. And I heard John, um, James Taylor, they just gave him a doctorate. He never went there, but they gave him a doctorate. Uh -huh. Yeah, so he's Dr. Oh, cool. James Taylor now from Berkeley. See, that never makes sense to me. Like, at least don't you have to have, like, a bachelor's or yeah, a master's? Yeah, I guess. What, I to guess play, guess play guitar? Like, well, they think it's too old to practice anyway. I guess it's like, you know, what is that seven-year thing? Um. You know, if you're living with someone, you become married after seven years. What's that called? Common right. law. Common law, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, what'd you study at Berkeley? That fancy guitar playing? Yeah, well, no, uh, that was my instrument, but I... Um, I so Berkeley is a wonderful place. I mean, if you could go there and graduate, it's... Moolah, moolah, moolah. <laughs> it's remarkable. It's yeah, great. I mean, it's hard to get through. It's hard it to is, get in. It is. It, it is, it is. It is. It's something you should be very proud of. Yeah, I, well, I studied songwriting there, and I minored in creative writing, so... So, all right, studying and songwriting, what do they tell you was in, like, in like three sentences? What's the key for a good song? Is um, there a template? A like, catchy chorus. Yes. Yeah. That's, that's it. Yeah. But, but I, I think that's changing a little bit. I feel like the chorus has become less... As long um, as you have a good hook and a beat, no one really cares nowadays. Yeah, exactly. Especially the musicians. I don't know. I heard that there's, like... <laughs> um, <laughs> I have a theory that it's changing. I feel like choruses are becoming less important. Um, less important because the verse takes up most of the song and people And do you think that hear... everyone just has ADD anyway and they can't even get through a whole song so it's like you have to catch So the up. verses need to be right. awesome too. Yeah. And they have to be even they awesome. Draw you in. Like Arizona Skies, what inspired that? Uh, I would have to say it was like my move from Boston to, to here. Even though I'm not from Arizona. <laughs> so. Have you spent time in Arizona? I have never been to Arizona before. What? That is a great <laughs> story, though. That's cool. I've never been to Arizona. Um, it's just, Do you drink the tea? Uh, no, I don't drink the tea. <laughs> we don't. I don't even drink the tea. Um, Mini Palata, baby. It's got the Indian face on it. And it's only 99 cents. <laughs> Indeed. Exactly. Wow. So what made you pick Arizona? Uh, just kind of the imagery it puts in your mind. Uh, I think I really wanted to uh, write a song about the desert and uh, just that old western kind of desolate. Did you know superstar Billy Graham is from Arizona? Oh, is he? Yeah. Billy Graham? The pastor guy? No, the wrestler. Oh. Superstar Billy Graham. Oh. I don't even know the wrestler. There's a promoter, Billy Graham, too. That's a very popular name. So, um... What's your website? Do you have any gigs coming up? I don't have any upcoming gigs, uh, but you can catch some of my material, some of my writing um, on uh, Facebook. 
If you go to facebook.com slash David Wellington Music. Yes, and it's on our Ruin Who page. You can check oh, that yeah. out. Check it yeah. Out. Check it out. That's, that's wonderful. So, like, how many songs do you think you've written, like, Berkeley style? Uh, probably, like, maybe five or six. Mm -hmm. I'm working on my sixth. But uh, that, those are my post-Berkeley. Those are right. the songs I actually want people to hear. Nice. Good for you. Good for you. So, oh, like, where do you, you want to see yourself in five years? Um, gosh, in five years, I, I hope to be playing in front of a lot more people. That's cool. Oh, okay. Okay. So, cool. Then, so then you want to be on a Crown Eagle Entertainment showcase in five years. Exactly. Yeah. Cool, cool. <laughs> so today is National uh, Welsh Rarebit Day, which is uh, technically cheese on toast. So we have some cheese on toast. For you, if you will share a skeleton from your closet, do you you look so clean cut and wholesome. Like, have you ever done anything bad in your life, David no, I've, Wellington? I've never done anything bad. I somehow don't <laughs> believe that being from Silver Spring, Maryland. Come on, you never flipped a bird at one of your professors at Berkeley or something. Uh, no, I never... Did you ever, like, uh, win a, uh, out of a ticket? Like, did you ever get pulled over by one of those troopers in Maryland? Oh my god, they're yeah. so scary. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah? Okay. Oh, yeah. What happened? Oh. What happened? <laughs> do tell, do tell. What did you do? I, I got a parking ticket. Well, I've, I've been pulled over. Silver Spring, Maryland, and that's just they the place. You over. They, they I know. Over. I used to be yeah. so good at talking my way out of it there, though. Um, but I, I got a parking ticket at, um, I briefly went to University of Maryland, College Park that's campus. That's where I went. Oh, really? Yeah. College Park? Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, yeah. Yes, one. I went there, and, um... They they get they're notorious for giving you parking tickets. Yeah, there. yeah. Yeah, so I park at their bookstore, I put um, some money in the meter and you know, I came back and there was a woman putting a ticket on my car and I um <laughs> I I pretty much just kind of um, bitched her out a little bit and um <laughs> that was the end of that. I, I drove off bitched out authority. Yeah, bitched out authority. Yeah, I don't feel too good about that, though, Aww. but <laughs> that's my bad boy story, I guess. And you had to pay the ticket anyway. I had to pay the ticket. Um, At least it wasn't a yeah. New York City ticket. You need to hang so. out with some uh, some friends of mine. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> get wow. some of that out of your system. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, Just show me what it's really like to be, like, a badass. Oh, <laughs> well, you look like you're doing pretty well, just being you. Yeah, I'm doing good. So, um... What are what are some other titles of your songs? Uh, yeah, I'm not too good with titles, I don't think. Um, one of my other songs is called The Voice. Um, Arizona Skies, and then uh, The Moon in Your Eyes, which is a really kind of cheesy title. Um, and then they all be Well, it is National Cheese on Toast Day, so cheesy works for me. Don't be embarrassed for titling songs, you know? <laughs> it's cool. I mean, uh, I mean uh, that's a song with that title. It's a kind of like a romantic sounding song, you know? Yeah. It'll it'll make the... Uh, and Moonstruck. It'll cheese. make the women melt like cheese on toast. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Yeah. Am I right? You're right. You're right. <laughs> of course you're right. So, um, do you like New York? You feel like the New Yorker or you feel like you're going to have to leave? No, 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 I love New York. Good for you. Yay, that's what I like. I know, I am. Here. Well, it's a it's great a town, it, but some people, you know, it goes either way here. You know, you either know you love it, or you know you don't. Yeah, I, th I think it's easier to love when you're uh, a night person. Are you a night person? Yeah, like when you when you have something to do at night, like yeah. play out, yeah. play music and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's fun. fun. It's fun. It is. It's yeah. a city so that never sleeps. Right Would you yeah. like to push a button? Yeah, sure. It's very DC. Oh, really? <laughs> Don't you think? You know, the rockets, they're always flying. Exactly. Do you have any last shout outs? Um, yeah, I would like to thank my friend Cosmic Ray. Nice. Um, I love Cosmic, Cosmic Ray. Cosmic Ray, yeah, he introduced yeah. us. So yeah. He's the reason I'm on the show. Cool. And uh, my friend Ian, who, who, used to, who was just standing there. Um, he just turned invisible, like soap. Yeah. Does anybody remember Ian soap? What by any chance? What was that? Ian Ford by any chance, or another Ian? Another Ian. Um, but yeah, he was kind of like my support, just kind of hanging out with me. 
Um, yeah, that's it. That's cool. Thank well, thank you so much. Come back anytime. Thank you for having David me. David Wellington. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll be back. Cause I'd be gone, so gone, so gone, it's plain to see. And then it happened.